What's up YouTube? What's cracking guys? How you doing? I'm finally back. I've been away for a while. I've been at my mom's place and uh, as I said in earlier videos I've been studying to be a personal trainer. And uh, now I'm finally, I finally completed the course. So I am officially a certified personal trainer as of right now. Also I've been sick for a couple days. So I haven't been feeling 100% great, but I'm back now to doing videos again, and I will uh, keep up bubbling. And uh, now, uh, on February 8th, this Sunday, uh, in just a few days, I will do my second full competition meet, and uh, we'll see how that goes. I'm gonna compete in the 105 kilo weight class, which is. Um, I think I think that's about uh, 234 pounds or whatever. But that's what I'm gonna compete in, hopefully. I'm about uh, two pounds over that right now, but hopefully that won't be a problem. At least that was my mo morning weight this morning. So we'll see. Uh, I did my last training session yesterday, and I uh, was doing absolutely fantastic, at least in the squat, because. I didn't think that my squat was gonna be any better since my last competition because I, uh, I haven't I haven't done very much uh, squat training and uh, also also I've, I've practiced more on widening my stance and um, I felt kind of much stronger uh, I mean weaker in uh, in a wide stance uh, but. Um, the last two leg sessions I tried to go back to my normal uh, wide uh, or I mean narrow stance just uh, for the sake of this meet coming up and um, I hit three PRs actually out of three possible <laughs> and I did uh, an, a new personal best on on. Uh, as many reps as possible on 140 kilos, 150 kilos, 170 kilos and I will upload that in a few days before the meet on Sunday at least and uh, well in these videos I have a, a few bench clips they have stored in my phone and um, this is the gym I were at when I was at m my mom's place and actually it was a, a pretty good gym and they have a lot of successful lifters in Sweden. Though I think you will have to be a part of their team and whatnot to, to get uh, access to all the stuff because they had like bars locked in and uh, I couldn't find any bands uh, which I would have needed uh, according to my programming uh, on one of the days. Uh, but I was doing pretty fine. Anyways, uh, my mom bought me some new shoes as well, and uh, you see I have them on me right there. They were like super tight, so <laughs> I only have them on the actual knee when I'm squatting, and then I drag them down again. So we'll see if I get some new ones later, but at least I will compete in, in these ones because I feel like they probably do add a few pounds or whatnot because because they're so tight. I think definitely they do. So that will uh, be fun for sure. And uh, I'm hoping to to up my uh, up my total uh, with at least uh, 20 kilos or 44 pounds because I, I don't think that will be a problem. I'm hoping for. 5 kilo better squat and the 5 kilo better bench press at least uh, and um, about uh, 10 to 15 kilos better on my deadlift than uh, what I did at my last meet and also that will be in the in the lighter weight class uh, so that's the goals and um, I'll make sure to to film my competition so I can upload that as well. And uh, after that, it's back to training. 
and doing a lot, a lot and lots and lots and lots of high frequency in every lift from then on, and not just the bench press. So I will try to bench, squat, and deadlift about five times a week. That's the goal. And uh, what that does, it allows me to train uh, shit loads of technique and uh, also work work my weak areas because I can do so many exercises like uh, all the time which really helps so uh, I will do that and I will update you guys about how it's going and how to do it if you're interested and because I, I think that's a really great way how to you how you do things but that's for another video thanks for watching this video if you liked the video and want to see more Please like, like and subscribe. We'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.